Hi, I'm Ajeev. Are you often mispronouncing words? Here are 15 words that you're probably mispronouncing and tips on how you should stop mispronouncing them and well, the right way to pronounce them. Welcome to CapShine. It's a revolutionary learn it together English fluency program. With CapShine, learning English is easy, quick, fun, affordable, and effective. We promise that with CapShine, you will become a whole new you in six months or less. Let's look at our first word. Pronunciation, how appropriate. Most of us pronounce this as pronunciation. This is incorrect. There's no ow sound in this. It's pronunciation. And one thing I'd like to have you pay attention to is the stress. Look at the A, that's where the stress is. So the word is pronounced pronunciation, pronunciation. That's how it's pronounced. Pronunciation is very important when we speak and to sound fluent. This is often mispronounced as says, says. This is incorrect, stop doing that. It should instead be pronounced says. Simon says that it's going to rain tomorrow. Says. Most of us call this coupon. Well, that is incorrect. It should actually be pronounced coupon. Coupon. Notice the stress? It's on ku. Coupon. The coupons gave me a lot of discount when I bought food online. Coupons. How is this pronounced? If you pronounce this as genre or genre, that's incorrect. You're doing it wrong. The correct pronunciation is genre. Notice how the stress is on genre and the re is softer. Genre. My favorite genre of novels to read is horror. Genre. This word is often pronounced as video. That is incorrect. The correct pronunciation is video, video. Notice how it's not an E sound, but an E uh sound, video. Speaking of videos, with a CapShine membership, you get access to a bunch of resources, including videos that can help you become a more proficient and confident speaker. With CapShine, you get a bunch of speaking opportunities that can help you become confident and fluent. You get access to fluency reports that tell you exactly where you are every month. You get access to personal coaches who give you specialized, tailor-made feedback that will help you go from where you are to the next level. And of course, micro lessons through videos and live classes that will help you build your foundations. Let's continue with a few more mispronounced words. This word, if you pronounce this as hotel, no, that's incorrect. The correct pronunciation is hotel. Notice how the second syllable is what's stressed. Hotel. I enjoyed my stay at that hotel. On those lines, this word is often mispronounced in various ways. Restaurant, well, I can't think of the other ones, but here's the right pronunciation for you. Restaurant. Re is the stress sound. Restaurant. And notice how the rest of the syllables are softer. Restaurant. The restaurant served really great food for breakfast. And along those lines is this word. This essentially means one of those fancy rooms where you have a bunch of other rooms, right? You have a sitting area, you have a bed, and you probably have a balcony as well, the fancier rooms. If you call it a suit, that's wrong. It's pronounced sweet. Yes, sweet. I was put up in a suite when I was traveling and I really enjoyed it. I thought it was pretty sweet. A common problem that a lot of Indians face and a lot of people in South Asia face is that they tend to add the E or E uh sound to words that start with S. A school is cool. Have you heard this being pronounced that way? Similarly, there are words like these that get mispronounced quite often, where they add an E or an E uh sound in front of the S word. To avoid this, one tip is to roll the S's. 
school, sports, special, spark. While you practice, make sure you do this and you'll realize that as soon as you start speaking and using these words, you automatically stop including the a uh or e sound in such words. Roll the s's. How do you pronounce this word? If you say that it should be pronounced subtle, you're wrong. It should be pronounced subtle. Here the B sound is silent. Let's look at a few more examples where the B sound is silent. Doubt, debt, climb, thumb, numb. Notice how the B sound was never a part of the pronunciations for any of these words. You never pronounce these words with the B in it. Great! I hope you had fun watching this video and you found it informative. If so, don't forget to like and subscribe. And also, do check out Capshine.com and download the Capshine app to get your free 30-day membership. Thank you!